Ah, it's you. Akihiko, how many times have I told you not to bring training equipment into your room? What would you do if the floor gave out? It says you with a room full of huge furniture. I'll eventually move it all out, just not now. <sighs> you always say that. I don't even get why you're lecturing me. This is just a waiting room. Either way, I'll be leaving the dorm soon. Graduation is close after all. That reminds me, Akihiko. What are your post-graduation plans? You've been fielding offers from many influential boxing gyms, no? Yeah. I'm thankful for the offers, but I decline them all. It's not like I wanted to go pro or anything. I just want the power to protect others. And I've learned that physical strength isn't the only kind of power. Instead, I'll go to college. That would give me more free time and future opportunities. It's still distant, but I'm starting to see my path. It's gonna be a long one, though. I see. That sounds more like you. Well, I have no objections at the moment. Thanks. I'll fill you in with the details eventually. Don't be stupid. I'd never go out with a girl who's this troublesome. She's much more of a comrade to me. We've been through a lot together, after all. To think you'd have the nerve to call me troublesome. I know I can rely on you, though. Of course, you're irreplaceable to us, too. We never would have made it this far without you. I sure hope we all stick together. As long as you're with us, we've got nothing to fear. I agree as well. But I have to say, you owe us one for this. If it weren't for LP being so obsessed with you, we wouldn't be in this mess. Oh boy. Hey comrade, do you want me to show you how to deal with Mitsuru when she's like this? Akihiko? Oh, look at the time. <laughs> Sorry, I got a training session now. I'll be going. Seriously, the nerve of him sometimes. If you'll excuse me, I'll be going as well. Yeah.